sometimes people miss the opportunity to have an encounter with the Father God and that was why we thought that we would start this ministry and and preach about Jesus and to look at the heart of the gospel to to really look into it to say where where can people's needs be met how can God encounter their lives and meet them where they're at so we've been seeing that at, every, at meetings everywhere we go people come from all walks of life from doctors to lawyers to ice addicts and God's encountering them and meeting them where they're at and what and fulfilling what they need in their life. So this is why we're excited about Flames of Fire Ministries. We are with the evangelist Matthew Morton, who's been traveling the world and has spent many years preaching and teaching about the gospel and the fire of the Holy Spirit and what it can do for you. So we are excited about that all the time. And So the goal of tonight is to raise faith in the room to a level that it'll actually make a transaction with heaven. So just like the woman with the issue of blood, she reached out to Jesus and she actually believed that if she could just touch the hem of his garment, that she would be healed. And it, we think God's sitting in heaven with a checklist saying, I will answer John's prayer because he's been a good boy, but I'm not gonna answer Sarah's or Freddie's prayers and I'm not gonna answer Bethany's prayers. But actually what happened is her faith touched Jesus and the power of God flowed out of his body and Jesus turned around and said, who touched me? He didn't even know who got a miracle until after it happened and he said, who touched me? Because he was doing every miracle as a man and he felt the power of the Holy Spirit leave him just like a, just like a, a person praying for someone would feel it. And he said, someone just touched me with faith because I felt the power of the Holy Spirit, the virtue of God flow out of my body. And that faith makes a transaction with heaven. So today we want to tell testimonies, we want to break apathy, we want to raise faith, and then we want faith that actually makes a transaction with heaven. And uh, when we make a demand on heaven, heaven invades earth. When heaven invades earth, earth can be saved. Earth can come to heaven. So tonight's about bringing heaven to earth in a way that people can experience Jesus. Then, then at the, after that... Um Con's going to um, give us the four count, and then we're going to just do shots, okay? So I'll do that part with the sticks. I'll go one, two, three, four. Ooh. Tonight, I just want to relax and enjoy ourselves. We're going to try to go up that rung on the ladder and, and bring, bring the, that anointing down here for God to say, yeah, I'm coming. Now is the platform. It's here. Okay? There before me a man appearing in the sky Who I stopped and stood and asked him who is he Four years seeking truth, and after a roller coaster, 
I, <laughs> I, um, I started to realise I wasn't bearing any fruit, I was a mess, and so this isn't taking me anywhere, and so maybe I don't actually know the truth. And then the Lord started to make me question everything, until eventually I was down on my knees, in a pit of despair, feeling the wrath of God, basically, and knowing, I'm, I'm, what am I being deceived from? So I asked him, please show me. And, um, and he laid it on me, and two weeks he answered me, and then I believed, and then a couple days later, listening to a worship song, the power of God comes in my room and delivered me of eight years of addiction. Wow. Just, uh, so now you're um, doing evangelism on the streets, yes. getting people saved. It's an honour and a privilege to hold a, and support a space where people get to connect with God um, and to provide that music for Him because uh, you know, the Father is obviously highly creative, and so to have input creative, creatively for a, a, a scenario where people get to interact with the Spirit of God is um, it's pretty pivotal and important to me. Um, and yeah, just feel very honored to, to play a part in that, for sure. So that's what we're about. We're really about that encounter with God and him meeting people where they need to be met.